are you at? Do you have a quiz for me? I do. Oh no. Good thing I'm in better in the mood. So I I had a I had a quiz for you. Um or I was gonna share the hey I told I told a bunch of random people where my books came from. The ch the chat room thing that I told you that mm -hmm. I kinda wanted to die. Mm -hmm. So that's my that's my reserved Becca's not here. Mm, okay. Um episode. So was that, it blunt sword? It was blunt sword. Or it is blunt sword. I remember. I'm proud of you. I am. I'm eating three packets of tuna. Oh my god. <laughs> um, okay, so watch. I'm gonna I'm going to remember this time to hit the microphone. Mm hmm To unmute us. So start recording this. Um this and now and now my friends we're here now my friends Benaga. we are here <laughs> and you were eating your meal prep i'm eating three packets of tuna you totally are and with um, mustard and relish and then rice cakes rice cakes how can you handle rice cakes they're this crunchy is an honest question no they're crunchy and slightly salty and then like if you <clears throat> eat it with your low sodium tuna with all the vinegar products that I have in here. It so tastes like, delicious. Bark is crunchy, but like one does not eat. Um, it fits in my macros it right does. now. And you also, no, I wanted to have apples, but we we are out of apples. And I was like, I could go to the store. Oh, no, they're in the fridge. No, but by now they're not going to taste good. And if no, I'm going to eat an apple at the end of the day you with tuna, fresh and it needs to be good. Mm. Like I'll probably just go to the store and buy a honey crisp apple tomorrow, even though they're like four dollars a piece. Now there are some in the drawer. I saw them, but it, by that by the time they move into the drawer, they're done. That means that they're mushy. The ones that I ate yesterday that were sliced, I was like, man. I'm so angry. You, well, struggling? I was already crying, and then I had mushy apple slices, and I was not excited. You, probably not a good idea to eat mushy apple and slices. And I was eating tuna while I'm crying. Like, I'm crying, and I'm eating mm. tuna. And, no, it's, I mean, it was tired. No, it was, it, was a, it was a hard week. It was a hard week. Today's a better day, though. I, I kind of hit that point where it turned around, so that's good for me. I'm really glad. And we haven't even talked about it. So, hi, guys. We were we'll just tell you. <laughs> I'll tell you all about our lives. Hey, my name is R.G. Long. I write the books. This is my wonderful wife who is representing her brand say, right And now. who doesn't read the books but mm -mm. works for Colts. Mm -mm, that's right. You work out. <laughs> I uh, do work out. I went to your gym this morning. A lot of people asked me if you were there. I was. And you're like, is that Ronald? That is Ronald. Wait, who was asking? Because I thought I said I thought I made my way around to say hey to all the PTs. Marie and Brian was like, I really wanted to say hi. He was poising him. You Brian, were poising yeah, no, yourself to say hi. But he said he had, he, he had he a client. He was super busy. Yeah, which is fine. And I then there it. were a couple other people who were like, they're newer. Yeah, that they met, saw you from afar. I met a new one new girl. Did she have curly hair? Yes. Teresa. Teresa. I wanted to say Teresa. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I met, I met Tracy. Teresa. Teresa. There is a Tracy. But, oh, no. Yeah, but she's cycle. Uh, no, so I met, yeah. So I was in, I was in your gym today doing mm -hmm. the back exercises, trying to stretch it out, make it better. Make how's, it better. How's your back today? It's sore because I did a leg day. Oh, how are your legs? Uh, they're going to be fine in a couple of days. <laughs> Later. <laughs> so, what I I had told you, um, I have another podcast ready to go at a point. When, yes. When you can't you can't make it. When my leg day is too, which is fine. Harsh. I also have another one that I'd love to talk about because I'm genuinely curious. Authors, most of the time, are introverted i was gonna say did you see my face like i did what? <laughs> you were nervous authors most of the time are introverted mm. so i'm curious um because this is supposed to be a show for readers uh of books not necessarily for authors there are plenty of podcasts for authors out there um are readers surprised when an author is extroverted i would be surprised that's a question for later uh i would be surprised i'm i'm honestly surprised when anyone's extroverted at all ever. at all ever <laughs> why would anyone why would anybody want to be like that when you could go in a cave we have discussed my cave before and we this it's a good thing mm -hmm. because when you come out of the cave you feel better i do and why would i not want that for you darling yes i do want that for you <laughs> uh hey i uh okay no this was cool i have this down here so i'm gonna it's read. a surprise uh, 
Kind of. I posted it. Oh, posted it's not. It on my Instagram. <clears throat> I posted so, it on my Instagram. You did because you're a supportive wife. Look at all this fiction. I can't even hold it without dropping it. So I'm. Look really at all this fiction. <laughs> excited. These are all my paperbacks. I have never had all eleven of them because I didn't even have all. I didn't even get like nine, ten. Uh, no wait. None of the the lattice series seven. Eight and nine. I didn't even see those in paperback. I haven't gotten them yet. Oh, so that's the first time I've seen those. And then that's. I like the cover. So I like this cover the best, but it's. Yeah, covers by Christian, great guy, fantastic dude. Really appreciate him. Yeah. Honestly, I think this one's my favorite. Spears. Yeah. Of lattice. Why? That's my favorite. I don't. Know, I like the colors. I like the green. I like that. Yeah. This one is striking. It is. Daggers of lattice I like is this striking. One. Arrows of lattice is good. Uh, oh, we're getting them all over. The this is all. This fun. looks like the one I just you just got me. This, this is my least favorite, but that's just me. It is too dark for you. Well, it's just because you need it in a in in a. I really like all of these. I have to have a least. You have favorite. to have one. This yeah. is my least favorite, but I do still like it. Then there's elves, my most tan. Uh, then the original three dragon mm. magic and sword sword, which people <laughs> tell me, like I have seen this cover. So that means I'm doing something right. Yeah, I like it. I like this one. This is but, a good first in series. Yeah. Uh, so this is all. These are all my books, and I want to talk I like about the arrows. I want to talk about what's in the books here in just a second. But oh no! First, oh, is there going to be a quiz on what's in the books? Because I definitely would not know that no, one. No, we could do that one next time. Oh my gosh! Well, what did I write about? What did I write? You know what? I, I may, can say a few. things. I might have talked about it enough. Maybe probably I'm not. I've also told you lots of spoilers because I know you don't care. Mm. It's, it's okay. That is true. Uh, ooh, I'm going to move this away from your face. I love how every time. Uh, and so I have for you a little quiz, babe. Uh, so the last couple times I made fun of myself when I didn't know muscles and was trying so to So now remember. it's my turn to be was, made fun of. Well, no, I think you're going to do okay with this. I think you're going to do okay with okay. this. So I didn't know muscles and I knew some of the books you had read. So I'm going to play a quick little <laughs> game called uh ronald can't make this work hold on just a second uh we're gonna play a a quick game with places uh oh. of fantasy things uh places of fantasy things yeah it's supposed to okay so it's supposed to be working so i have this maybe if i click that there you All go right, so i don't know what's going on there all right so uh where's we're gonna play a game that at? we're gonna play a game called where's that at all right, so I'm going to put up a picture of a fantasy place, and I would love for you to tell me oh. what, either like the movie oh. or what you think is kind of it's close to about. You're gonna get you're gonna get most of these. I mean, I really if there's about. Hunger Games, I really well, that better is, be on there. This is I, more. This is more fantasy. fantasy. Well, then I'm, but, I'm not. Okay, we'll try. Do you remember when you had confidence in me with muscles? I have confidence in you. Uh, oh, okay. I was like... So you were like, it's the radius. And I'm like, I don't know those words. <laughs> <laughs> the radial, because it's the bone that goes over the bone. No, okay. I didn't yeah. know. So, Break okay. your radius. So I have, I have some fantasy places Okay, I will here. try. Um, I'll try to describe them for those of you listening at home, mm -hmm. not watching at home. So, oh, gosh. Uh, so here's the first one. Uh, this is a castle on a hill. Uh and oh, is that... this one is one that is probably familiar to people who started reading these books when they were younger. I'm Hogwarts. That is totally Hogwarts okay. I was right like, there. that's a that it's is a not what I'm stylistic drama. Oh, okay, yeah, Hogwarts, definitely, yeah, for sure. It's not it's not quite the Hogwarts of the movies. All right, uh, here's the next one. I will I will give you if you can even name the uh, series. So it's this is a live action thing. Uh, a live action what does that mean live action so it's it's real people oh so i was like is, wait the yeah, picture no. is of real people this is a, the picture of real people oh uh the person in the middle has blonde hair there uh there is a very short person uh to let's see her right it it look i don't know anything about this but only because the blonde and the short person, I'm guessing it's Game of Thrones. It is Game of Thrones. Okay, okay. I was like, that is a long shot. <laughs> no, well done. Yeah. I know, I told you I had faith in you. Okay, so it's King's Landing. Okay, yeah, which is no, that the... would have, I just know 
the Game of Thrones. So Game of Thrones, the the big Iron Throne with all the swords. Mm-hmm. That's this is where that's at. Oh, okay. The the throne is in there. And King, you know the King's only Landing. the only reason I would even recognize those characters is because I've been told I look like one of the characters, and I've had to Google it a few times. No, well there you go. Who do you who were, have been told you, you look the, like? She's the one that's also in the Mocking Jay. So she's the that. one with the the buzzed head. Oh, and but. Yeah, I'm not familiar. I will have to. I mean, yeah, I'll have to Google it like right now. Yeah, Anyways, no, we could okay. re-Google that. So you you look like a Game of Thrones. Character. I do apparently. Neither of us have seen a single episode. Okay. Nope. Uh, this one is from your childhood. That's from the Never Ending Story. Boom! Yeah. I knew you were going to get <laughs> like, that. Okay. I, uh... So that is the Ivory Tower. Yes. Ivory Tower from uh, Never Ending Story, and that's where the princess with no name lives. Yes. I did have to Google that. You did have like, to Google that part. Uh, I did do that right before we That's started. That's funny. Uh, here's another epic fantasy thing that we've seen a lot at our house that you've seen. And the hint is it's not a book person. It's not a book. Uh, it's another form of entertainment. Is is that from Zelda? It is Zelda. Okay. okay. Like, yeah, it's yeah, either that or the Dark Crystal. The Dark Crystal. <laughs> crystal they are remaking it did you see that no not only are they remaking dark crystal but why it's a netflix so it's oh serial and i gotta see i'm looking at the game of thrones and people. it's not cgi oh they're, they're going puppets again they're going puppets yeah so that like huh. the orig- like the original dark crystal oh. i started to watch the trailer uh i got distracted i went to, i did something else um but they are remaking dark crystal hmm. that is a thing that is from our child. Did you watch that a lot, or did you ever watch that movie, Dark Crystal? Yes. Okay. Did you, you did you watch it like several times? That was like that and Drop Dead Fred, <laughs> were I, kind I, of yeah. I knew Drop Dead Fred. Yep. Dark Crystal freaked me out as a kid. Not I mean, lie. yeah. It's not the it's not the most pleasant. No, there was some weird stuff in there. I'm so, still trying to look. That's totally fine. So all of these places are fantasy locations, right? I got all of them. You did a fantastic no, job. No, did I? You did. Yeah, you got all of them. So the, well, only, I feel... the only one I was I was thinking you might have a hard time with. Oh, actually, no, there's one more. Oh, no. I forgot. I forgot. There's one more. But you should you should know this one. Um, all right. So, yeah, one more. Oh, that's the Shire. Boom. Okay. Oh, that, well, that's, isn't that? Oh. Oh, if you can name either of the residents of this house. I know I they're be... hobbits of yes, some kind. Hobbits. Hold on, hold on. Let me think about it. Why? Uh, Hold on. Because it's like, and I don't even know where this word came from. I know it's not Gimbley, but I don't know who that is. Gimbley's a dwarf. Okay. I was like, and I don't know what series that's in. Frodo? Yes. Is one, and I don't know the older wow. guys. Wow. Okay. The no, older I'm guys. Very, honestly, I'm very impressed. I don't know. I just remember that he, when also he got the. O. Also ends with an O. Frodo. Oh, and... no. Hold on. Oh. God dang it. Do you want a hint? I'll give you... I'll give you... Mm. Vanilla? <laughs> Bilbo. Boom. <laughs> okay. Wow. Bilbo Baggins. Oh. Yeah, I haven't even read the I'm book. This thing I was like, we're, we're done. done now. We're I'm done. not... Yeah, I haven't well, even... No, um, I, I am you're impressed now. legitimately impressed. Yeah. So I failed the muscle quiz. You just nailed the fantasy location quiz. I win all. You're done. Like, I, look I'm, at you. I'm still trying to find my person on the Game of Thrones. <laughs> um, no, I'm very, I'm very impressed uh, because these are fantasy locations that are uh, integral to the story, uh, right? So the, the, the location... I don't want YouTube. Is almost as important as what's going on. In are we going story. map? Is this where we're going? We're going map. We're okay. going. <laughs> I was like, we... So like when I. We travel by map. So we travel by map. It's so easy. Mm-hmm. That is a Muppets reference. You're welcome. Ladies and gentlemen. Uh, part of getting a paperback book for me is getting the book and looking at it and feeling it. And I mean, I'm selfish, so it's got my name on this thing. So which is cool. I get to look at that. But when I get a paperback book. I don't know about you, babe, but I look to see if there's a map. Like that's never. I always look to see if there's a map. I but I don't read 
things in a fantasy world. Yeah, ours are always mine's always like I even tried to read like the girl with a dragon tattoo, and it was set not in America, and I was like, oh heck no! Down. I was like, I can't. I don't know what they're talking about. I don't know where they at. Andrew Larson thinks my summer haircut is looking fly. Thank you, Andrew. He didn't style it though. He has not. Which I was going to say something about it, but then I decided not to. But you thanks for that, Andrew. It's all right. We're gonna we're gonna work on that. Right now, it's not up. So, this is my I cut my own hair and took a shower. That's Look, right. That's exactly what this is. No, so when I when I got my first map back, I was like, this is this is my fantasy world. So if you don't know, and if you haven't read these books, each of these uh, bottom words. So there's sword, magic, and uh, dragon of rune, and that's where they that's the rune is a continent where this takes place. So there's the rune trilogy, which that is the first one. Then there's Iridan trilogy, which has a another map in there, uh, Iridan, and then there is lattice. Oh, lattice. Right? Ah, but it's because I like the arrow one. So there's lattice. This is spears. This is the yeah. the ninth one, uh, which has its own map and then the latest one nah, I, um, Redact oh that's, yeah Redact so Redact uh, of course has its own map I think Redact is I like the shape of it that's cool for me I like that it's one it's very Peter Pan yeah like Neverland mm-hmm. I'm, a, I'm a big fan of this so the crazy thing is I've got one more uh, continent, continent yes. to go so right now I'm writing Towers of Redact uh, and so this is this is my last uh, foray on Redact, and then there's one more continent. Are you going to tell us what the continent is? So it's it's Galen, uh, G A L I N, G A L I N. So uh, when I've been dictating it, it it, it comes up as Galen, Galen like G A L L O N. Oh yeah, totally. So that'll be that'll be fun to go back and replace. So Galen is trying to get it out there. Uh, Andrew, your favorite series? Let's see the. Girl with the Dragon Tattoo series. So Andrew likes the Girl with the Dragon I just tattoos. don't like the fact that I don't know what they're talking about. I don't know the distance between this and that. And like I just... This Russian city and that Russian city. Is I, it Russia? I have no... Andrew, I is think it Russia? I don't know. But Andrew I'll, would probably. Yeah. Natalie Dormer. Is That's who they who say look like? I look like. Babe, you totally look like Natalie Dormer. I to- they're like Natalie Dormer. And I'm like, please remind me who we're talking about. I don't know who it's okay. is. But Natalie... Can I see a picture here real quick? Natalie Dormer? Yeah. I mean, yeah, you look like her. Who's her? What's her character's name? I don't know. Okay. Natalie. Now you're asking too many questions. Sweden. Okay, it takes place in Sweden. Ah, uh, okay. Which I am equally unfamiliar with the geography of Sweden. Yeah. As I am with the geography of Russia. Yeah. Natalie. Natalie. Natalie Dormer. Dormer. I have to look yeah. that up. That's so there who, you go. That's who my that's, wife looks like. That's what people at Starbucks are like. For the record. Yeah. You're prettier. Oh, th- thank you. You're welcome. Uh, Margie, What's that? Oh, Margie Tyrell. Oh, that's her. That's her Game of oh, Thrones character. Oh, I don't know what that means either. Andrew so. doesn't actually know that because he doesn't actually watch it. Andrew, do you actually watch Game of Thrones? I've never seen an episode. She's also in the Tudors. Did you watch that? Andrew. We're judging you so much. I think Melissa, his wife's Melissa. Melissa watches it. Andrew, I'll let you, I'll let you say that. It's, we'll get you off the hook on that one. It's Melissa that Just watches kidding. the Tudors and Game of Thrones. I'm sure it's Melissa who watches Game okay, of Thrones too. Okay, yeah. I have no idea. I don't watch any of the, none of those interest me. Uh, maybe the Tudor. I thought the Tudors would interest you. No, it not the if it's the one on Netflix. I was like, nah, no, I can't watch this. You can't do it. Okay. Yeah, I watched okay. Rain and I liked Rain, but that's not that's <laughs> historical fiction. That's it's not like even historical fantasy. Historical pop fiction. Yeah, because of all the pop songs. Yeah, never saw the Tudors. Oh, read the books in college. Okay, there you go, Andrew. That's fine. All right, I guess. Uh, that's okay. <laughs> Lo- I, I'm a big fan of fantasy locations. Yes. And so for me, I'm like, as I'm writing these books, like planning the world and, and like, uh, Iridan's going to have this giant ocean in the middle of it, sea in the middle of it. That's mm. a big deal. Rune is going to have a whole lot of snowscape. And uh, Redact right now has uh, a lot of kind of deserty places and things like that. Uh, deserty. Deserty. That is a adverb. And then the... Uh, Oh. Lattice was mm-hmm. lots of jungle. Mm. So Gallon is going to be, spoilers, not really, uh, more volcanic, more oh. more desolate. I was kind of trying to think of like what would be the next thing. So volcanic. Volcanic. Think like in game boss, like the boss level. That's what I... That's, you know, that's very head. Guardian of Gahul of you. Isn't it though? Yeah. 
<laughs> another fantasy series. You've I read, read that all one. Of them. Yes. They're, they're There's like 15. 15. Yeah. Really, I'm just trying to be like the Guardians of Gahul. That's what I'm trying to it's do. It's a great series. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's what I'm trying to so do. So our nine-year-old agrees. Yeah, she does. She's currently <laughs> reading Keeper of the Lost Cities. So thank you, Messenger. Is the last name of that author. Oh. Messenger. Fake name, fake name, fake name. Fake that's name. Right. Yeah. Uh, real quick, I want to get in uh, my wife's opinion on a cover. I like that one. Uh, this cover is by Andrew Hodge. or this Aaron. Aaron, excuse me. Aaron Hodge. And it's called like Daughter that one. of Fate. That's it's, very Game of Thrones-ish. Isn't it? Like, I like it. Yeah, I do too. So I'm a, I'm, I'm a fan of that too. Daughter of Fate, it's actually a new series. He's like starting this week, mm, this series. Gotcha. So are they on pre-order? It's on sale. So you can go ahead and get it. Oh. It's 99 cents until June 6th. Awesome. That's a thing. So if you like uh, Kindle. That's three days, FYI. That is three days. Today is June 3rd, right? Yes. Right. Totally. I've days. written it so many times today. Oh, lots of writing. Lots of citing the, things. The date. Mm -hmm. And this one says, uh, the tagline for him says, when knights attack the temple of Skystead, 17-year-old Pila is the only one to escape. Her mother and the other villagers are taken, accused of worshiping the false gods. They will pay the ultimate price unless Pila can rescue them. So there's already some uh, some danger going on here. Already, like right out the gate. Like we, we're going to start with all the dangerous stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, Aaron has been somebody I've talked to a little bit on Facebook mm -hmm. and is an author that I'm excited to see where this new series goes. Is he a new author? He's not a new author. He has, he has, he has lots other of series. other series okay. that you can read. So if you like that one, you can go ahead and grab uh, the rest of the stuff that he's yeah. going on. But I think I think he's going rapid release so oh, gotcha. hopefully, if and you... Aaron, correct me later on if you need to, hopefully if you like it, um, the others will be quickly following, mm -hmm. which is a great thing if you if enjoy you're like reading an... indie authors. Yeah, I'm a, I'm like a serial reader. If if yeah. I like the series, I want it, it to be, I don't want to wait. Mm -mm. Well, that's another one of the things of trying to finish up. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, my word count right now is at 5,700. Mm. So I'm so excited uh, because my strategy of small of rewards and it's been working. has been working and so that's been working so i've written a lot this week so i'm feeling good we're gonna go on vacation we are gonna go on vacation and it's just gonna be you and me it's You're gonna good. be awesome i'm looking forward to it so we're gonna go and do that and we might we might get some writing done but we might not i'm not writing anything there you go babe hey thank you so much for hanging out and for listening and if you uh, have a favorite fantasy location that you'd like to share and share that in the comments let us know where maybe you would like to visit if you were given the chance where would you go definitely not the volcanic land not of... volcano land <laughs> gallon <laughs> there you go hey, hey thanks so much for listening thanks for hanging out and as always watch this is a great this is this is a great thing i get to do it's a laugh line enjoy the journey oh dang i was gonna <laughs> I had the wording wrong. <laughs> All right. Bye, guys. Thanks. I was going to say, remember the journey, but that didn't, make any, the didn't journey. make any sense. Enjoy the journey. Enjoy the journey, Andrew Larson. The tutors. Oh, I'm on mute. It is.